This year's U.S. women's national soccer team could become marketing superstars, but only if they win the World Cup. We haven't had this much focus on women's soccer in America since 1999. That team won in front of nearly 18 million viewers. Brandi Chastain, who scored the winning goal, became an endorsement star after this iconic moment. Her teammate Julie Foudy did several ads for Bud Light, and superstar Mia Hamm is still doing commercials. Mia Hamm has always been driven by one thing, winning. This year's team has a lot of potential off the soccer field. It's full of established stars like Abby Wambach, Hope Solo, and Alex Morgan. All three have deals with Nike, which also makes the team's jerseys. Those three are playing alongside young rising stars like Julie Johnston, Kristen Press, and Morgan Bryan. But many Americans still don't know who these players are, despite a big push on social media, including much Twitter love by superfan Tom Hanks. Some say the team just hasn't been in the spotlight enough. It doesn't help that star goalkeeper Hope Solo has some off-field issues, including an arrest for domestic violence, charges that were later dropped. But this team has still got a lot of profit potential. Some of the players are already in ads. Press has been featured in a commercial for Coppertone. And there's this chapstick spot with Alex Morgan, but it doesn't actually show her playing soccer. She and her teammates could cash in just like Chastain, Foudy, and Ham did 16 years ago. But they have to win it all. Nothing less will do.